Thousands of followers of Muqtada al-Sadr took to the streets in Najaf on Friday to attend a funeral procession for senior aide Riyad al-Nuri, who was assassinated in the Shiite holy city earlier in the day. Al-Nuri, the director of al-Sadr's office in Najaf, was gunned down as he drove home after attending Friday prayers in the adjacent city of Kufa. The mourners chanted slogans against Prime Minister Nuri al-Maliki's Dawa party and its ally, the Supreme Islamic Iraqi Council, led by Abdul Aziz al-Hakim. The mourners pelted the compound of the Supreme Islamic Iraqi Council with stones. The protesters also intended to attack a police vehicle, but they were prevented from doing so by clerics taking part in the funeral. Authorities immediately announced a citywide curfew, and security forces were seen deploying on the streets, which threatened to raise tensions amid a violent standoff between al Sadr's Mahdi Army militia and the U.S.-backed Iraqi government. In Baghdad, meanwhile, Iraqi police said that three people were killed and seven injured when a rocket apparently aimed at the U.S. protected green zone crashed into the Palestine Hotel, blowing a hole in the wall. Police said the victims were mainly pedestrians on the street below.